In this video, we are going to run the check disk utility to check a disk for errors. You can do this at any time to check hard drives for potential problems, or if you forget to safely remove a USB device, you could check that too. So, first of all, we need to find the drive letter of the storage device that we want to check. Open computer from the start menu, or my computer on Windows XP. Now, I can see the drive letters of all the storage devices on my computer. If I wanted to check a floppy disk, for example, I'd note that its drive letter was A. For this example, I'll check my Windows drive, Drive C, here. Now, we need to open a command prompt. Vista and Windows 7 users can do this by searching for CMD from the start menu here. XP users can use the run option on their start menu and enter CMD and press OK. We'll need administrator privileges to perform a check disk. XP users must be logged in with an administrator account. Vista and Windows 7 users must right click on this icon and choose run as administrator. Then click continue and enter their administrator password if prompted to do so. OK, so now we have a command prompt window. Enter the following chkdsk space c colon or the letter of the drive you want to check space forward slash f and then press enter. If you are checking a secondary hard drive or USB drive, then usually the scan would begin right away. If you are checking your Windows drive, however, you will usually see this message. Type Y and press Enter. Now, close the command prompt window, either by typing exit or by clicking the X here. And restart your PC. When Windows starts again, Check Disk will kick in and scan your hard drive before Windows loads, fixing or reporting any problems it encounters. This scan will take some time, so I'm going to pause the recording until it's complete. When Check Disk is finished checking your disks, it will show you this report and then restart your PC again. And that's all you need to know to use Check Disk on your PC.